So what we're studying on this project is how the chemistry of the inlet changes over the course of the year as the oxygen in the water gets consumed by the animals that live there. Saanich Inlet is a natural dead zone in that it's, um, it has low oxygen content and other places in the world, like particularly the Mediterranean Sea, we're seeing these dead zones expand due to raising uh, water temperatures. And when these dead zones expand, they change what species are able to live there, including a lot of fish and shellfish and things people depend on to eat. The main goal is to intercompare all these measurements from biology to chemistry to dissolved gases to understand what happens over the course of the year as the oxygen content in the inlet changes. We're coming out every two weeks um, to the same location to make the same measurements so that we're going to actually get a very, very good picture of what happens over the course of, of a calendar year. I signed up for this project because it's an excellent opportunity for me to gain more research experience uh, and to develop some more laboratory and technical skills. We're partnered with uh, the Institute of Ocean Sciences, which is Fisheries and Oceans Canada. Uh, multiple scientists from there are uh, taking samples from our, our water bottles and analyzing them for various species, chemical species. And then we're also partnered with Ocean Networks Canada, which has provided both um, instruments that are in the inlet to help us understand what's happening when we're not out on the water, as well as scientists that are making uh, other measurements and staff on the boat as well. I am out on these trips to help uh, collect physical data and so then I can compare that to our uh, buoy profiling system to see how um, accurate it actually is. So our outside collaborators are, are world experts in their field and are, uh, we're very interested in taking part in this study because our sampling methods are very rigorous and very regular um, and the Saanich Inlet's special ge geology allows for uh, these, these interesting oxygen dynamics which they're which they don't have access to in their part of the world. It's so neat to be able to go out on a boat and take samples and then go back and, and analyze them afterwards, um, just as a part of the class, so you better understand uh, why you're taking those samples and the different cycles that go on in, in Saanich Inlet. Um, it's a very unique experience, and I wish more students had the opportunity to do that.